Hey, what's going on everybody? Welcome back to Call of Cthulhu. Uh, this is part two. So without further ado, let's go ahead and jump right into it. Alright, so uh, from where we left off, we're supposed to be heading into Warehouse 36, which is <clears throat> the place that the uh, the guy owned or the lady owned. I'm trying to remember how to run. Okay. They've kind of moved this a little bit. Let's see what, what it says. Have done so much damage. You can't understand. You're not sailors. These guys must have something to say. Right? You live here. Why did you do that, huh? We saw what you did to St. Brendan. Yeah, we'll teach you to come onto our island and ridicule our protectors. What is he talking about? Uh Let's try to keep it calm and civil. I respect your beliefs. Our beliefs? You mean you don't believe in God? That's irrelevant. That's what you think. There's you, our beloved statue, and then those two bozos behind us. Wait, now that I think about it, it's got to be them. There's one of them who's always going back and forth to the statue. Quieter. It's kind of all we need for them to hear us. What brings you to dark water? Uh, I'm let's just go ahead and leave, man. We'll see you later. <clears throat> we'll go ahead and leave because I'm trying to figure out how to get to. They told us enough information, like we need to come and talk to these guys about getting into the warehouse. Oh, actually, we could probably sneak by right here. No, if it gets out, I'll. Serious problem. How could you be dumb enough to leave the entrance to the warehouses unguarded? Keep your voice down. Why not go and shout at the cat while you're at it? I don't want to end up with her little knife under my throat. It's a stiletto, you idiot. And with that smell on your breath, I don't give you much chance anyway. Okay. So they left the warehouses unguarded, which means we can sneak on by. Uh, obviously not through there. I said we have to run around the back way. I think probably back, yeah, around here where those the group of guys were coming from. That was where the first time, but I was like, ah, uh, let's walk all the way down towards the end. Go to more obvious path. There's a bunch of people sitting off to the side. Here we go, right here. Find hidden spots. The spot hidden skill allows you to take hidden items at a close range. Okay, this is what it's talking it about. It looks like there's a way in under this grate. So we gotta figure out how to open it. Um, where's that lead to? That pulley up there. Okay, and there's the ladder. Can we climb up the ladder? There we go. I could use this old winch to lift the grating. Oh, we need a but tool. It's been completely taken to bits. There must be some spare parts amid all this clutter. Can we just drop down? Oh, we gotta use it later no matter what, okay. Thought maybe we could just go ahead and dive bomb off of it. Something there? Yep. This handle is what I perfect need. For the winch. Get up there. <clears throat> it's like it's not responding to whenever I press A to it. Or maybe I'm moving too fast. Mount the handle. I'm confused. I mounted the handle. Am I tripping or something? What's happening? Oh, I have two of these things. Let's add some of them. We're going to do it to... Let's do... <sighs> Why not? Yeah, psychology. We'll do it to that. Validate, yes. There's other people we got. Okay. So why is it that I cannot use this, this winch? Now that I put that, plate, that piece on. It's got a clue thing going on. What is it saying? Yeah, 
Yeah. Trying to get everything out of the way. Knowledge. What is it gonna say? Okay. Let's go back down. Maybe we need something else with the winch. Either that or my game's glitched out, one or the other. I don't know. We'll come back down and then we'll reset it and see what happens. I don't know. It's not giving me the option to do anything with it. If the newspaper clipping in the bar is true, this bone is a real fossil. This ratchet device seems to be... Uh, I didn't have everything together. That's what it was. That's my B, bro. Restarting the whole game because I'm tripping out. Alright. Now we have everything I together. Use this old winch to lift the grating. Let's <laughs> mount the handle. And mount that piece. We're missing something else now. One more piece that we don't have. Let's see. I already checked around here. Oh, I went somewhere right here. Ah. Uh, Should be possible to mount this cogwheel on the winch. Oh, okay. That's what that that blinking green question mark thing is. I see now. All right, turn the handle. Looks like everything is in its place. All I have to do is turn this handle. Sweet. So you pull out your lighter, it'll help you see things better, I see. Alright, let's drop down into the green abyss, I guess. I don't know if I would <coughs> trust all this. Am I about to, do I need to go back up? <laughs> like, is there a way to get that out? I wonder if I can just sprint through it now. You know what? Let's try and sprint through it and see what happens. Oh, this ain't creepy at all. We doing a whole lot just to get into this warehouse, man. Oh, hey. Oh, hey, dude. Nah, I see. I got a... My boy's tripping out right now, bro. <clears throat> bro is tripping right now. I would be too, though. I can't lie. Occultism. This is primitive. Okay. Like I said, I can't get down with the water, man. Not knowing what's so funny. That's why I used to swim in the ocean a lot now. Not so much, man, because that right there, stuff oh, like that is what trips me out. Stinks. What is the connection between this place and the Sarah Hawkins case? The inner reconstruction scene, okay. What happened here? Punch the glass. Someone treasures this crumpled picture to the point of sleeping with it. Okay. 
Is this one of Sarah Hawkins' paintings? The reconstruction scene. <clears throat> what is this picture? It looks like it's them. Her husband and her. The Hawkins people. Cut themselves. Anything crazy? What is this green light? Because that's not no normal light. And whoever it is has something to tell me about the Hawkins case. Is there anyone in there? Yo, don't move. Detective Pierce. Why wouldn't he try to hide? Stay away from this warehouse. Mmm, what do I do? Hold to test psychology? Okay, you let's do it. You seem like a competent officer. We should help each other. You're trying to manipulate me, Mr. Pierce. I hate to be taken for a fool. Oh. All right, Inspector Lestrade. Let me take a more direct approach. Can you explain what this painting is doing here? This strange portrait. Wait, I know it. It was in the Hawkins mansion when we came to investigate the fire. So you confirm that it was removed from the crime scene. Interesting. I'd like to go and see the mansion now. Of course. You want to go back along his trail? <sighs> I'd like to understand how this painting made it to here. Come on. My car's parked down the way. Andrews, would you please shut the door? And open your eyes, damn it. This guy went right under your nose. Well, those, those must have been the guys that were over there talking. Her again. Uh uh. This case has nothing to do with you, Baker. Clear the passage or I'll shut you up for obstruction. Officer Bradley, you've finally grown a pair. Too bad you're too fat to see them down there. Why you? Come on, keep the smile. You don't want to force me to widen it. Okay, I get it. Can we go to the mansion now? <laughs> Who the hell are you? What were you doing on my turf? Who was this chick? I've got eye on you. We'll meet again. Oh, this is the girl that they was talking about. She ended up slicing a third or something. Mansion. behind you at the top of the ridge you see the building that's the Hawkins mansion come on we got some driving to do how big is this island though Here we are, Hawkins Mansion. The place has been abandoned since the fire. There's only old Winchester in his hut. Okay. Spy him professional. Huh? Oh, why is Caretex doing here? He's clearly not doing any gardening. You know. Silas Winchester has been working for the Hawkins family as far back as I can remember. Charles was like a son to him. The day of the fire, he lost his whole family. So he's got nowhere to go. And, as you'll see, in a way he's still watching over them. Is there anything else you want to ask me? Or do you want to go up there? Uh... Let's do an investigation. You're the one professional. who looked after the Hawkins case. <laughs> <clears throat> Don't think I was trying to hide it. It's just that this discovery shakes my convictions. That's why you're so keen to find out who removed the painting from the mansion. Yes. If something escaped us, or if there's been a law enforcement error, then it's up to the police to make good its mistake. 
Anything else? Uh. Let's go and get going. And I want to be able to see when we arrive. I'll go with you, if only to reassure Silas. Okay, cool. You can help. Right. Let's go. Yeah, that only, and not because I'm kind of scared to be alone walking up to some creepy mansion. I mean, did the fire really? I mean, how did the fire catch the whole place, though? No way they couldn't have got out this big place. Big old mansion. Ugh, excuse me. Where are we headed, my boy? You gotta walk all the way around this stuff just to get up there? Are you going the right... Is it the right way? I was thinking about it, like, imagine if it was raining or something, bruh. You gotta walk through all this just to get back to your house. You're gonna get drenched. The flowers on Sarah Hawkins' grave are fresh. The old caretaker must be very attached to her. Sarah Hawkins? Someone must really hate Charles Hawkins. I told you. Silas Winchester is still watching over the Hawkins family. I must say, it's pretty gloomy. So, detective, does this place inspire any thoughts? Obviously, he doesn't like the husband. Do you know if Charles Hawkins had any enemies? Not to our knowledge. He was a well-respected personality on the island. I don't understand. Silas would never have let such a thing happen. Oh, maybe it wasn't him. Mm. Let's go to the mansion. Oh, I want to look at the kid's grave, though. Poor kid. I didn't expect to set foot back here after the burial. What kind of deranged individual would defile this sanctuary and steal a burnt painting? I don't see Silas doing such a thing, let alone allowing it. Even that broad baker is above that. Lord, have pity on this poor family. Uh, no cup kicking around, bro. Let's go. <clears throat> I got places to see. Okay, so I guess I'm going by myself. Okay, cool. Bro, the yawn's killing me. Oh my gosh. Hopefully we won't run into old Silas. I don't think I'm trying to come in and do anything. I'll have to find another entrance. Alrighty. He's in the caretaker's place though, so we should we should look for that and see where it is. This entrance is still in use. Oh my gosh. That scared the freak out of me. You are trying to force the door, you nosy prick. Easy, sir. All right. Put down the axe. You know what we do with rubble like you? We gut them. Dump them into the ocean. <sighs> You're Mr. Winchester, lower that axe, and let's talk calmly. I'll show you how we have it out on dark water. Uh, you haven't forgiven yourself. Know. You stay here to honor the memory of the deceased. That's true. I want no more violence, no more tragedy. It's painful to be the last one left. You don't know how right you are. Understood. I'm listening. The police report describes a domestic accident, but Stephen Webster has several reasons to believe that this may not be the case. Webster is as stubborn as an old mule, and I did tell him that we should let the dead rest in peace. He wants to restore the reputation of his daughter. I just need to see where the fire started. No, I can't let you in. The mansion isn't safe. That's why you barricaded the entrance. That's right. And this door? It's locked. And I make sure it stays that way. Uh... 
Uh, let's do online you still answers. put flowers on her grave. You cherish her memory. Mrs. Hawkins was an exceptional person. She cared for everyone around her. Let me shed a light on what happened to her. Give me that key. Hmm. I'm probably making a big mistake, but it won't be the first. Here, take the key and do what you have to do. Go on, then, just to get rid of you. Let's see what more I can learn from this mansion. Alright, so it was just that easy? My boy just let me slap yes. through like that? Shall we, Anna? Let's go ahead, big dog. I forgot you was coming with me. I thought you was going to stay down Let's there looking at his graves. I'm with you. Follow me. I know the place. <laughs> Who left this light on? Obviously, somebody's been going in here. Silas, the only one. Let me pop my lighter up into the last that. supper of the Hawkins. What does this tell me? Reconstruct sane. What is that? This roast. What strange creature has flesh like this? Not actually, though. What is that? This place is for the head of the family, Charles Hawkins. The boy was probably here. Smashed his plate on the floor. Well, he got mad about that. Sarah Hawkins plate. Why did she leave it untouched? Something happened at this table. An argument? Hmm. Well, she what? She's still alive and hiding. Daydreaming again. Working, officer. This dinner table tells us a lot about the Hawkins family life. Well, we don't have all day. The scene of the fire is next door. <laughs> now they didn't have to make it that creepy. Now come on. Why didn't anybody? I mean, they ain't come in here and clean or nothing. Maybe not tour it like that. What is this? Managed to bring the fire under control. But Let's see if I can find off. something the cops missed. I just cut that dude off. I'm just like, let me talk to myself. The child's corpse left a trace. Where are the others? They had it's a nice fight. To out. Why? Something right there. Did Sarah Hawkins lose one of her shoes? How? Not the husband. Or he been drinking. Was Charles Hawkins a heavy drinker? He ended up killing him? Missing something. Did it stop at the time of the fire? If There's the a painting, painting I found on the docks really came from here, how come it didn't burn? Something else I'm missing. This? Did someone escape the fire? We trying to say Charles Hawkins got out of there? He's the one that made the fire and got gone? Blood. This lamp was thrown. This was no accident. This was a fight. Someone fell. Desperate attempt to flee. Hmm. That same toy was in there on the table now. 
So, detective, what do you make of it? Uh, let's not do the main one. We'll do this one. I firmly one. believe this fire was more than just an accident. <laughs> What's your theory? I think the Hawkins couple got into a fight. You sure of that? There's only one way to be sure. Where are we going right now? I just ask that you don't disturb anything. If Chief West found out about what we're doing, I'd be in serious trouble. What are we about to do? Is a real question. I don't know what we're doing. And where is we going? Like, gonna show. These bandages are covered in dried blood. The same bandages that I saw in the warehouse on the docks. And given the blood stains, I'd also say that it's the same person. Bro, old Charles is still alive. That's what it is. An original edition of Mary Shelley's Frankenstein, dated eighteen eighteen. It's quite a building, don't you think? Do you know that the Hawkins were among the wealthiest families on the island? What do you know about Charles Hawkins' activities? Well, not much, to be honest. We all assumed the Hawkins lived on Charles' inheritance. Hmm. Moby Dick. Melville's classic. The epic battle between man and whale. Mandatory reading for any whaler, I guess. What are we looking for? Oh, we got something of progression. What happened? Did my light go out? Why my flame go out for? I bet that Charles, Charles Hawkins still alive. That's what I'm starting to think. Just turn his back on because I don't like that. One of Sarah Hawkins' paintings. Her style sure is recognizable. 20,000 leagues under the sea. Never read it, heard of it, though. about the mysteries of the deep. So right now, all we can see is that Charles Hawkins what is a could drinker. Sarah have done to make this person threaten to call the police? Dear sir, <clears throat> as you know, I have always held you and your family. have respect. Unfortunately, I can no longer continue to close my eyes on the behavior of your wife. Last week, she again terrified my clientele. I know that she means no harm, but you should place her in the care of Dr. Fuller. Her, 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 he alone seems to be able to make her come to her senses. These services were to recur. Believe me that although it would feel like torture, I would be oblig obliged to involve the police. police. Anton Willard. It looks like we would have to figure out who old Anton is. See what she, she was doing. So she was crazy. I was starting to think that maybe she wasn't crazy, but maybe she is. Oh, something's about to happen. Locked. I don't like this. Look, it looks like somebody scratched across, went across that painting. Ooh. What will her room reveal about her? They had separate rooms. They didn't sleep together. Padlock door. This padlock is too complicated for me. <laughs> no shot. Barbiturates. Sarah Hawkins must have been extremely agitated resorting to such a treatment. That is a depressive nervous system, but once you begin, you can never live without them. That I know something. Dang. There's something in there, though. Or is that... No, that's light coming from the window, my fault. Well, it looks like everything leads up to this door right here. All these scratches. This door is locked. All the doors locked? Freak, dude. I was wondering, maybe I can... It's a way for me to... How many do I have unlocked? Medicine, strength... 
Urban ability to influence those. Spot hidden. Uh, understand my vision based on his or her behavior. What if I want to do this one? Wait, hold on. Can I take one back? I just want that. And then let's go back to psychology. Ah, dang. Okay. At least we can talk to people better. Whose room is this? The little boy's room. What are we what are we reconstructing here? A child's fort. From what threat was Simon protecting his world? Hmm. Tom Sawyer. Mark Twain. Sarah must have read it to him before bed. I don't know the book. Sleeping pills. Strong for an 11 year old boy. What was wrong with this family? That cult stuff she was drawing, she must have been a part of it. What nightmarish vision could have inspired them? Simon's troubles went beyond family problems. That kid saw something. Something terrified him. Uh, we better come back and see the same thing. I think that was everywhere we could go, is it not? That was the boy. Well, we can't get into that room, but that was her room. This was the boy's room. Pause. Oh, okay. This was her room. I'm sorry. I got mixed up. Let's go talk to the officer, see if maybe he can unlock the door for us. wherever he may be he's still he's just standing here looking at the bookshelf still if you're right we should be able to find clues among the Hawkins personal effects okay so I'm missing some obviously an original edition of Mary Shelley's Frankenstein my fault yeah we are later that some what are we missing this door is blocked from the outside. Maybe some all the way back up at the top. Or maybe there's like some secret, secret, <laughs> secret passage to get in somewhere. I feel like it should have been something over history. here. This place was settled back in 1692. This door, did I try this door? Two families that seceded from the New England colonies. No, I, I couldn't do it. That's why. That was that weird painting. So there's got to be something down that way. Oh, okay, okay. It'll burn you. That's why it goes out. I don't like that, though. Then he'll turn it back on. Okay. What are we missing? The locked. door was locked. I already did the boys' room. There was something here we ended up didn't see. Can I shut the door see what happens? It's no use. The padlock won't give. I'm, it's something here that I'm looking for, okay. What is it I'm looking for? This door is locked. Ah, we got it. Sarah Hawkins' office. Is that this or is that the other one? 
It's no use. The padlock won't give. Okay, so is this, this is her office, Gabby. Yep, she was doing creepy stuff, bro. The door is blocked on the other side. What the freak is that? Oh, heck no, Despite man. Despite what happened, they seem to have loved each other. Fate brought us together and forever it will be kind to us. This ledger lists all of the paintings Sarah Hawkins sold. If I got, bro, she was making some, oh, it was returned. But she was making some doggone money, boy. 1,000, that probably had to be like a million it back in the, the day or something. was given for free to a Francis Sanders. I wonder why. Anything else we're missing? There's a painting that was in the middle, right? Was Sarah Hawkins interested in the occult? What was she trying to achieve? What a cult, though, are we talking about? Creatures now you anchor her dimension and impulsion and ritual might work as long as the person performing to make sure that he integrates the elder sign among the glyph that make. Uh, uh, because the word that describes the creation of certain circles are not all proven reliability. Uh, missing anything in here. Shit, all this stuff. All I know is whatever it was, bro, something keeps making scratches. Bradley? Is that you? Oh, heck. Is anyone there? What's finna happen? That him? That cold people's running, bro. You gotta get him. Stop. He just jumped. Alright. That was a little dramatic because it wasn't. Bradley, did you see which way he went? Who? I didn't see anyone. I just heard some noise. Are you all right? A man was hiding on the upper level. He ran when he saw me. He can't be far. I'll cover you. I did bro not see him. One light source to the other. We'll pull another lamp. Was that closed. Closed. earlier. Where did he go? Obviously, his bookshelf moves, but let's look at everything else. It looks like an old seaway map. Nothing there. And the levels, okay. Clearly, Charles Hawkins knew Captain Fitzroy very well. I wonder who the man with the glasses is in the photograph. Probably another really friend of Hawkins. The that came in here? This globe seems to have been part of some mechanism. <laughs> it's so funny. It do be talking in the background. My guy just does not be caring at all. What am I supposed to do? Oh, I gotta figure out. That's what unlocks it. Okay. <laughs> Doesn't work. I must have missed something. That was it. Looks like it worked. Here's where you go and where they found the beast at. Well Let me done. just make sure. Looks like the navigational paths described in the log. It didn't really look very, very good, but I guess it was close enough. Because that's where 57 North is where. The seaway map. 
57 North. Where's that one at? Yeah, that's where they found the huge wheel. Okay. We got that. Let's go ahead and go through. Secret passage under the manor. It's like a detective novel. Um, guy must have got I, I think this is where we're going to stop yeah. this uh, Sega part. He had a direct means of entry to the crime scene. We must find him. Okay, buddy. But I think this is where I'm going to leave uh, off the Sega part. Um, We've gotten about, about an hour into it. Uh, the game isn't too long. I think when I looked it up, it's about six hours, five, six hours long. So it's not too long of a game. Not a lot of action going on, but it's more of a story-driven game. And the story is pretty good, and I like it. So I uh, hope you guys enjoy it as well. If you haven't already, like, comment, subscribe, man. I'll see you guys in the next one. Peace.